Hello beautiful souls. I hope you all are doing well. Welcome to your weekly reading. So for today's reading we have three groups. Group 1, Group 2 and Group 3. Group 1 is going to be this Selenite. Group 2 is the Angelite. Group 3 is going to be this orange selenite. So go ahead, close your eyes and pick or choose a crystal or a group that you're most drawn to or the one that you resonate to. And I will uh, see you at your reading. Uh, remember that I mentioned the timestamps in the description. So you can click on the description, go to uh, your uh, to the timestamps that are mentioned against your group click on the timestamp and it will take you directly to your reading uh, don't forget to like comment share and subscribe as well all right welcome group one and this is for all those who resonated with the selenite honesty and communication So uh, you are, uh, you will be given an opportunity to speak your truth in case, you know, there are times when, you know, we are unable to speak the truth and we don't have the courage to, uh, you know, uh, speak the truth. You need to ask your angels to help you, to give you that strength so that, you know, you can speak your truth and uh, it's time for you to be honest and communicate honestly. And it's not about being being honest to others. It's about being honest to yourself as well. And, uh, you know, uh, speak with your feelings. Whatever you feel, speak, speak truthfully. Okay? And the angels will support you. Spiritual growth. So this must be a, uh, this is a very powerful time for you, you know, uh, uh, things, uh, things must, must be unfolding around you in your life. Uh, you must be feeling more connected to the angels or to your purpose in, in life. Uh, so your angels are encouraging you to keep expanding that knowledge that you have and, you know, keep learning, uh, you know and growing uh, keep learning from your spiritual experiences and that will lead to a spiritual growth transformation it's time to leave behind the old you you know it's time to leave behind the old uh, limitations that you have uh, the old beliefs that you have it is like you know uh, a butterfly that is emerging from its co uh, cocoon and you are now ready to fly you are now ready to you know uh, uh, fly and take that uh, you know f uh, leap of faith you are being removed from a stagnant energy currently you are going to leave everything behind everything that was holding you back and you will move into the light Okay, so that's all I have for you, group one. I hope you resonated to this reading. And I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you. Welcome, group two. And this is for all those who resonated with the angel light. Friendship and union. So, uh, this is a time for coming together, you know, you might be meeting your friends. Uh, so, friendship and the other connection and other connections are important right now. It is time for you to strengthen your bond with, with, with others and with your friends. Uh, it is important to enjoy your friendship also with others and the connection that you have with, with people. Uh, in case you feel disconnected or, you know, out of place, uh, know that you know you are moving from that place and moving to a joyful space so your your angels are asking you to connect deeply with the people whom you trust the most 
and enjoy yourself spend time with your friends be present listen smile enjoy the time with them compassion so the angels are going to wrap you with the light of compassion around you and they are ask uh, they are guiding you to let go of any conflict or uh, any need to you know prove that you are right or you know you are higher than the others uh the angels are asking you to look uh, at the other people's in case you are in a conflict it is asking you to look at the other person's point of view also with compassion and most impa- uh, importantly be compassionate to yourself and it's asking you to look at yourself also with compassion there are times you know we 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 get we feel frustrated angry so at that time it's asking your angels to shine their light upon you and the situation that you're going through and look at the situation with compassion and you will see the change you you will see the uh, the way you look at the situation will be different power and intention so you need to align with the highest good and act or uh, and act with love and uh, you do have the capability to be a leader and a guide but then you need to do that with love and you need to think about the highest good not only for yourself but for for everybody al- around you so uh you know don't hold yourself back call in your angels and and you know i uh invite them to help you listen listen closely uh to the voice of your soul so that you can move forward you can move forward you know effectively and and you would you will they will guide you to take the next step forward as well all right so that's all i have for you group 2 and i will see i hope this reading resonated to you and i will see you next time for your next reading thank you Welcome group 3 and this is for all those who resonated with the orange selenite. Power and intention. So you need to align your intention with the highest good and act with love. And uh, you know your your angels uh, are reminding you that you need to act with love and you need to think about the uh, your highest uh, good not only about yourself but the highest good of of everyone uh, you do have the capability of being a leader and a guide at this uh, at this time but you need to align yourself with love okay you need to call your angels and invite them to help you listen closely to the voice of your soul so that you can move forward and take that step forward strength and guidance you know that you are a powerful soul and uh, you know currently uh, you you also know that you do have you're capable to rise above any challenges that you're going through and divine intervention is taking place at this time and uh, uh, you just need to be uh, become more uh, aware about uh, where it will lead you and how it will lead you to fulfill your purpose okay uh, your angels will guide you to you know uh, will, will guide you so call upon your angels for guidance and they will help you understand uh, they will help you understand the situation better and they'll help you to take the steps that you need to take to move forward courage and bravery so you have a heart of a warrior and you want to do what is right but you know doing what is right isn't easy always so uh call upon your angels the angels will surround you in the light of courage and they will guide you to do what you know deep down in your heart is right 
you know uh, you they they will give you the strength to be brave and they will give you the strength to be courageous and take that step forward uh, they will also give you the strength or the courage uh, to you know own up your situation you need to own up uh, uh, take ownership of the situation and through courage it it will you know it will guide you you know that you are protected so you need to let go of the fears that is holding you back and be brave uh, call in your angels and 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 uh, uh, you know uh, call them and tell them to shine shine uh, their light on you and the angels are always around you to protect you and you know that you are protected you are divinely protected so you need to let go of all those fears that is holding you back all right so that's all i have for you group 3 i hope you resonated with this reading and i will see you next time for your next reading thank you